Arena's film story opens with a scene where two combat warriors are shown using their weapons. This fight is being watched online by the public showing excitement. Logan is running this game online at the office. While warriors kill another. The text that has been written, death game is shown on the screen. The other masked face person appears. Shooting the companions with the gun, he decapitates them. Meanwhile, viewers talk with one another as is it a reality. The other says it is just a movie with special effects. While the third one says, no no, it is reality. I learned about it from my brother's informant. The movie's main character named David Lord is shown. Playing football in the next scene of the movie. After playing, he comes to his wife standing beside a place. His wife was expecting. Both move towards the car. They are going while his wife starts conversing. His wife named Laurie says you express your opinion. And emphasize others to accept its reality. It is good thinking. David halts his car carelessly and the other car crashes with it. The car is topsy-turvy and firing is started as David gets off the car. Coping with them, he finds his wife soaked with blood. And she is no more. Two months later, David is shown in a bar in Mexico where he is intoxicated. She asks the bartender girl to serve him bare placing the money on the counter. After a while when he goes leaving the bar. Bartender girl gesticulates a nearby standing boy to go after him. As he goes after him. David pushes him inside and falls him down. He is seated again asking the same girl about his alcoholic drink. A sitting girl Mila at a distance. Who is the recruiter of the death game is observing everything. She offers David smoking going after him. But David tells, he does not smoke. The same girl reaches David's house with him. And asks about his wife. David tells her, she has died. Waking up in the next scene. He knows that he has been captivated at a place. He speaks restlessly and also hears the voice of a man. Peeping through a hole, he finds a victim like him sitting aside. He befriends him. At the same time, different voices of people are heard. They say that the thing which is advancing here is death. That masked person is an executioner who says. Your name is David. Either you will have to kill or die. David asks, who are you? What do you want? That person leaves without saying anything. David utters someone, help me. Suddenly, the sound echoes. Some people enter inside and they inject him with a pistol. Leaving him unconscious. Boss Logan and Mila talk about David in the office. He is my game and responsibility. Mila says I have recruited David. Her boss says it is the game of my world. Hearing it, Mila leaves at the place. Where David is captivated. David is talking to another person through the wall hole. He tells David, you were born to die. But David says, don't repeat it. That person tells that his wife used to make him strong. Waking up in the next scene, David finds himself chained. Sitting on the floor before him, Mila asks his name. And what was he named his newborn son? Then Mila says, your wife was most beautiful who is no more. You live or die depends on you. You have a passion. Saying it, she leaves. Meanwhile, some males enter inside and David shouts no. No. Chaining him and they take him away. And written text death dealer appears on the screen with a photo of David. The opponent appears for fighting. On the other side, Lagan is running this game in the office by these ladies. David's opponent is provided a weapon by them. David fights without a weapon. In spite of this, he gets victory breaking the hand of his opponent. Then masked executioner Cardin arrives there and decapitates the loser. David is again brought back chaining. After a time, the same person again goes to finish David. Stopping him, Logan says that he has to fight to become a part of our game. We will make him as such that he will be our fighter. Now David is standing captive before the head Logan. 
Logan says I know I am manic for you. David calls him, sick. Logan tells that his father used to arrange a fight in the backyard cheering the winners. You are such a person who wants to fight but does not yearn to die. Smiling ironically, he says that he will be released after winning 10 games. Showing his friend's wife on screen. He threatens him if you don't kill your opponent within 3 minutes. I will finish your friend's wife. He is the same captive friend in the cell. Now David comes for the fight. On the other side, David's masked opponent appears. The fighting is started. Then David attacks him violently as a result he is unmasked. He sees his fellow friend and is left astonished. His friend observes the cross time limit on the screen. And his wife is finished cutting her throat with a knife. David and his friend are afflicted. At the same time, the same masked executioner comes and orders. Kill him. His friend gesticulates him to do as such. David decapitates him courageously. Viewers call this game, awesome. David's eyes well up with tears as he murders his friend. David says the last fighter card and executioner will be killed by me. That person accepts this offer. Thinking no one could cross the fifth contest so he will also be unable. Then Mila arranges a separate room for David seeing his troubles. And herself cares for his wounds. In the next scene, David fights many times. And Mila applies ointment on his wounds every time caring for him. Otherwise, Mila fulfills all needs of David. Further, Logan in his office says to the last fighter of David. That David fights as better as you. David asks Mila to convey his message to his brother Sam. Saying it, he leaves. Mila tries to contact Sam online by sending him a message. That I want to contact David's brother Sam. She is asked, who are you? On it, she replies that I am just his friend. It is asked if it is fun. Mila says, she just wants to send the conveyed message to Sam by David. There is a tournament that night. Which is between the death dealer and the executioner. David is injured badly while fighting. As David falls down. The memory of his wife and brother Sam emerges in his mind which creates energy in him. Now it is known that David is an agent. And conveying a message to Sam is part of his plan. The purpose was to inform about the location to superior agent. Thinking about it, he begins to hit his opponent. After a few times, the siren echoes. It is clear that police officers are advancing towards this office. Boss Logan is got worried. While David beats his opponent angrily recalling the past memories in his mind. At last, he fractures his neck. Viewers are pleased speaking loudly kill. Kill. Boss Logan tries to escape collecting all amounts. But David pursues him because of his death deal. He is about to kill him with his weapon. The police immediately enter inside while opening the door. And orders them to throw your weapons. David surrenders while Logan escapes. Going outside, he finds his superior agent McCarty. Mila and both assistants are arrested. David tells McCarty that Mila is the cause of my survival. McCarty informs that Mila is in safe hands. Then David is taken in a car.